सी आई ई टी एन सी ई आर टी प्रेजेंट्स टू यू दीरीज नेक्टर ऑफ पोएट्री फ्रेंड्स इन दिस सीरीज वी ब्रिंग टू यू द पोएम्स बाय सम वेल नोन पोएट्स ऑफ इंग्लिश इन दिस प्रोग्राम वी ब्रिंग टू यू द पोएम कॉरोमेंडल फिशर्स बाय सरोजिनी नायडू फ्रेंड्स यू मे हैव हर्ड ऑफ द पोएट फ्रीडम फाइटर and a patriot she was also known as the nightingale of india she was a sensitive poet her themes were based on the beauty of simple joys and sorrows of life naidu served as the first governor of the united provinces of agra and oud from 1947 to 1949 the first woman to become the governor of an indian state She held the position of the president of the Indian National Congress in 1925. This particular poem is about the sea and the fisher folk. Coromandel Fishers Sarojini Naidu Rise brothers rise The wakening skies pray to the morning light. The wind lies asleep in the arms of the dawn, like a child that has cried all night. Come, let us gather our nets from the shore and set our catamarans free to capture the leaping wealth of the tide, for we are the kings of the sea. No longer delay. Let us hasten away in the track of the seagull's call. The sea is our mother, the cloud is our brother, the waves are our comrades all. What though we toss at the fall of the sun, where the hand of the sea god drives? He who holds the storm by the hair will hide in his breast our lives. What? Do we toss at the fall of the sun where the hand of the sea god drives he who holds the storm by the hair will hide in his breast our lives sweet is the shade of the coconut glade and the scent of the mango grove and sweet are the sands at the full of the moon with the sound of the voices we love but sweeter o oh brothers the kiss of the spray and the dance of the wild foam's glee row brothers row to the edge of the verge where the low sky meets with the sea The poem addresses the fishermen telling them that it is dawn and time for them to set out in their boats to gather the wealth of the sea. The speaker urges the fishermen to wake up and be prepared to ride the stormy waves of the sea. A life of comfort relaxing in the cool shade of trees is very attractive, but the speaker believes that hard work is much better. The speaker urges the fellow fishermen to go right up to the horizon and test their own limits. The sea is presented in all its various moods: calm, happy, leaping, stormy, and so on. The relationship between humans and nature is beautifully brought out by referring to the clouds as brothers and the waves as comrades. The catamaran mentioned in the poem is a long kind of a boat. Dear friends, if you have not seen the sea, I hope you visit the seashore one day. Meanwhile, you can try to find out the names of various kinds of boats and their uses. Friends, you were just listening to this program. Subject coordination Dr. Ravindra Kumar. Subject expert Dr Vardha M Nikalje Support Department of Education in Languages Artist Rajshri Trivedi 
रेकर्डेड बाय बटी लैंगलिंगडो प्रोडक्शन एसिस्टेंस मयंक थपरियाल डायरेक्टेड एंड प्रोड्यूस्ड बाय वंदना अरिमर्दन दिस प्रोग्राम इज प्रेजेंटेड टू यू बाय सी आई ई टी एन सी ई आर टी न्यू डेली इंडिया